What's up y'all, it's Courtney Chanel. Thank you so much for clicking on this video. I am actually in, that was not corny. I just literally, my phone was still recording from the last take. Um, my background is a little bit different. I am actually at the casino in a hotel room right now. My husband is playing in a tournament and I'm just chilling in the room. You're gonna hear a lot of noise in the background because Lincoln and Sanaya are both here with me. So um, if you do hear anything, just know it's the kids. So I realized that I never did a introduction video. I thought I would do the get to know me tag. So I got these questions from youtubesociety.com. So let's get started. My middle name is Chanel. My favorite, my favorite color really depends on the day. Today it is purple. It's always purple, but it's always purple in some other color. My first best friend was my little brother and I know this all like mushy, but no, he really was my first best friend. Um, and then I have, as I got older, I uh, got some more friends, but he was my first best friend. I am 5'4", which is not short at all, but I'm the shortest in my family, which my nickname short comes from. Everybody is touching six foot in my family. That is Lincoln, he is banging together some Legos, so I'm sorry. I am actually allergic to cats, so I'm gonna have to say dogs. Funniest moment through school. I don't think there was like a funny moment through school. I've had quite a bit of um, embarrassing moments, but I don't think there was anything funny. Um, let's see, my boyfriend fell at a pep rally. <laughs> How do you remember that? You weren't even there. He told me. My boyfriend fell at a pep rally. Uh, I don't have any uh, funny moments. Mm -mm. I don't have any funny moments. I have only been to two countries, Canada and Mexico. I did go to college, not the college that I wanted to go to, but I did go. Favorite subject, um, I'm gonna say English as a favorite subject, but only because um, I was good at it. It wasn't like something I really enjoyed, but it was just something that came natural and easy to me. Actually, I didn't even know I was good at English until uh, I went to high school and I am so sorry. And, um, my counselor looked at my grades and was like, you do really well in English, let's put you in AP. And so that's when I was like, okay, I guess English is just my thing. The worst subject, ugh. I don't like doing math. I can do math, I don't like doing math. I, I hate math, I hate it so much. I can do it though, I can. I just don't like to, I don't want to. Say hi. Say hi. Favorite drink, I only drink water and coffee, so I guess water. Favorite animal is a turtle. I don't know why they bring so much joy to my life, but I love turtles. They're so adorable. I love, love, love turtles. Just thinking about it brings so much happiness and joy to my life. I don't have a favorite perfume because my husband... <laughs> I don't have a favorite perfume because my husband doesn't like um, strong scents, so he can't even take lotion, so I don't get to wear perfume. Tea or coffee? I do drink tea, but hey, I'm talking here. I'm doing the talking. I'm doing the talking. I'm doing the talking. I'm sorry. <laughs> uh, I do drink tea, but um, I'm more of a coffee lover um so you know i have two kids um my son's name is lincoln and my daughter's name is sanaya now sanaya's name came from dad i did not choose that name i didn't come up with it daddy came up with that and um he thought that was sana lathan's name but he was completely wrong it's sana lathan not sanaya lathan um but that's where that name came from and if i could have named her or if i could change her name I would name her Autumn Chanel or Janor Chanel. Something a little bit different. What do you think about those names tonight? Terrible. Okay, well I guess she wouldn't like her name growing up. Sports, I did not play sports, but watching my daughter play sports and um, be active makes me wish I would have. I am really loving her playing softball and I wish I would have done it. Make sure to check the link down below to watch her softball highlights from the past season. Some of my favorite YouTubers, my for big name YouTubers, I'm gonna say Thomas Adriana and Nature B. I would love to be best friends with either one of them. 
and then for small youtubers I have so many so make sure that you check the links down below I'm going to list them down show them love they're really dope youtubers my favorite movie I'm not gonna tell you out a name of it I'm just gonna do a few lines from the movie and then once I'm done saying the lines pause the video and put in the comments where these lines came from my family can't answer because they already know what my favorite movie is I want you to be very sure about this this means you're gonna walk out of here with absolutely nothing except my name I give up all that other stuff but only if I get to keep my name I work too hard for it name is mine and got my daddy blood on it to go she, 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 she can go she can go wherever she want to go but the name the name stays home <laughs> okay pause it and tell me where that came from I am of course taken y'all know that married for this is gonna be my fourth year <laughs> sorry this is gonna be my fourth year my idea of a perfect first date or an ideal first date honestly is just Netflix and chill without the Netflix and chill like literally I just want to watch TV watch a movie eat food and chill that's it like that's perfect for me me and Roger do that all the time and I love it I have only had one boyfriend that really matter favorite childhood memory I have so many memories growing up we um went to my grandma's house all the time and me and my cousins would have so much fun I have so many memories but my absolute favorite memory is my ninth birthday party um my mom and I were down at the laundromat washing clothes. I think we were washing clothes. I'm not sure if we were actually washing clothes or not, but we were down at the laundromat and we walked back to the apartment and it's pitch black in the house. And um, the lights flick on and my dad jumps from the kitchen to pretty much the hallway and yells, surprise. And all of my family in front of me and my friends. And I was so, scared y'all <laughs> I was so scared and I turned around I started screaming and crying and hugging my mama because she was right behind me and um, I was so terrified like I didn't know what was going on but going back and thinking about it I was like that was that was a really dope really cool uh, surprise party and yeah so that had to be my favorite childhood memory I uh, I took five years of Spanish but I am so rusty I cannot speak it at all and I can't really understand it as well as I used to but I can read it because I can take my time and dissect it but um yeah that's pretty much it Spanish I have I have five siblings I grew up with two of them and then three of I have three sisters my fashion sense is super chill so I just wear t-shirts jeans and Air Max tennis shoes um, whenever my husband and I are going somewhere, I dress up, of course, and wear heels and some jeans and a cardigan or whatever. But yeah, I'm real chill with my, well, whatever I wear, like now. And uh, let me just, and I made this shirt today. It says Poker Wife, because like I said, he's um, in a tournament. So my favorite restaurant is Cracker Barrel. I love breakfast food. I will eat breakfast food for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. I will eat it all day, every day. I love breakfast food and I love Cracker Barrel's pancakes and I love their cornbread. If y'all haven't tried the cornbread, try it, trust me. My favorite TV show, I am a reality TV junkie and that's really bad and I know, but I really love um, Real Housewives of Atlanta. That's actually my favorite show. I love Welcome to Sweetie Pies and I do dibble and dabble into um what's that stuff with the with the ghetto folks oh so love and hip-hop atlanta i don't watch any of the other ones but i do kind of watch a little bit of Lo love and hip-hop atlanta i do not know how to work a mac don't know um i think i've tried a few times and never got it so i'm gonna say pc right now i am using an iphone I had a Note 4 and it broke, so my husband had to get me something. Of course, I couldn't get the Note 7 because they were exploding and whatnot, so he got me an iPhone just until Samsung comes out with another phone. Bad habits. This is so bad. I know it is. It's so bad, but I have a bad habit of crack cracking my knuckles and my toes. It's so bad. I know that's nasty, too, but <laughs> I can't help it. Like, my fingers and toes get stressed out, so I have to pop them, and I do it without even knowing I'm doing it. I just... What's so funny? Sounds so gross. I'm sorry. I have to do it though. Like it if I don't, if, if it does make your fingers fat, that's the the myth. But I have to because if I don't, my fingers get like real stressed out. <laughs>
Okay, that was the last question. Thank you so much for watching this video. Don't forget to look in the description box below to watch my daughter's softball highlights and also check out those really dope YouTubers that I was talking about earlier. Also, one last thing. Don't forget to subscribe. Thank you so much for watching. See y'all in my next video. Bye. So y'all want to see um, how to record in the hotel room? You take one of these lamps that's on the, uh, the nightstand you plug it up wherever you're gonna do your video and lay it flat so the lighting is coming towards you and then that was just the lamp that was on the desk it worked right <laughs> bye